Hey guys, so we're going to start this as the third episode for my prep updates. Um, sorry for sounding the way that I sound. I'm kind of getting over back to back colds. Um, I kind of was feeling it during my last vlog. Um, and then I started getting better, and then all of a sudden caught an even worse cold. Um, like last week sometime and uh, it wasn't really a cold, I wasn't coughing or anything, just really congested um, and uh, nose running and if you guys watch uh, Michelle's channel you can see that we had a, a vlog um, uploaded yesterday or last night and uh, you can really tell I'm all red in the nose and I sound really nasally and stuff so that's just another hurdle in prep I mean, you know, you, you kind of have to roll with the punches, you know, it's with anything, uh, whether it be, you know, having to cut down protein, having to cut down fats, having to cut carbs, carb cycling, you know, I mean, you know, depletion and all those things. I mean, those are all just hurdles. And I think that if you get sick when you're on prep, it's pretty much the same thing. It's just a hurdle. Um, very early on in my prep, um, before I pulled out of the sack, I had broken my big toe on my left foot <laughs> and um, even though I broke it um, within a week I was back in the gym going as hard as I could because I knew that I had to push myself um, I mean I'm not telling everybody that if you break something to get back in the gym but I mean I had already spent months and months um, getting ready to start prep and it had happened like two weeks into my prep and I figured might as well just keep going and not not back down not slow down just you know focus on the task at hand prep right now um, I have changed up a couple things um, actually starting today I'm, I'm cutting more <laughs> I'm cutting more calories out um, not only am I at very low carbs I think out right today is a workout day. I think I'm at 20 net gram or 20 grams of net carbs for today. Um, but I'm also cutting some protein out as well. Um, uh, roughly about four ounces over the course of the day. Um, whereas I normally get, you know, you know, uh, five ounces per meal. Now I'm only taking in four ounces per meal. Uh, next week, what I'll probably do is I'll start cutting fats as well as well as keeping the car, uh, proteins low and the carbs still low. Um, so, I mean, today's going to be a rough one. And then I'm also kicking up cardio as well. Um, right now I'm doing an hour in the morning, an hour at night, and uh, or an hour after workouts. And what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to have to bump it, depending on how my energy level is, um, after my workouts. So we're going to see how that goes. I think the combination of dropping protein amounts, calories and also um, the low carb and the added um, cardio should really kick start some more stuff going on in the next couple weeks so I'm looking forward to seeing what the outcome is over the next couple days um, should be a big progress um, so that's pretty much it for right now um, I'm gonna keep doing these on every Sunday, getting them uploaded and getting them out there and then the Sunday after the show you'll see, oh this is what I did at the show kind of thing and it'll be a big surprise kind of thing. I just don't want to really um, broadcast it of what I'm doing so um, just stay tuned and uh, if you have any questions, comments, you can always hit me up here, comment below, uh, you can shoot me a message, an email however you want. Alrighty guys, so if you have any questions, hit me up.